hello friends today in this tutorial i'll be showing you that how to extract the channel id and the youtube video id from the url that is given using a node.js library and we will be converting to express application so the library name is pretty simple if you just search for this library i have also written a complete blog post on my website so the link would be there inside video description if you want to download all the source code this is a blog post so if you go to npmjs.com node package manager this is the official website search for this package this is a package here you can see it's only 17 weekly downloads is there it will get you the channel id and the video id as well so let me use it so just make a brand new node.js project npm in a dash y and then you need to install this package the command is given here i have written the com blog post in the video description simply copy this command and paste it and you will install this module after installing it you need to simply uh, include this module right here so it supports uh, two methods first is channel id and second is video id and uh, then we can simply get the channel id like this by using this method so here you need to pass the full url of the channel that you want to get the channel id so you, you can see this is a youtube channel it has got this id here simply we will copy this uh, full url and paste it here and like this and then it will return a promise to it and it will hold this id so here we can simply console log the id so this is the channel id so basically if i run the application so we will say node index.js so now that basically you can see this is the channel id it will return to you a garbage string of values this is the actual channel id and uh, now if i try an another channel here you can see this is another channel basically this is a format full url paste it here once again so now once again you will see this is a channel id and it also supports the video id function so if you want to get the video id you need to copy paste the url of the video so let me take my video for example so basically let's suppose this is a video this is a video id portion that we need to extract simply you need to copy full url and paste it again this will return a promise then and it will hold the id So console log the ID. So now this will extract the ID. So if I run this, you will see the ID is extracted. You will see Y, C, and you like this. <laughs> so now we will convert this to Express application, guys. So we can just install Express and also EJS template engine. So install these two dependencies, and uh, this will hardly take few minutes. So now we will run this application node one so now what we will do is that we will start express server express we will make a simple express app so we will start the server at port 5000 and in the callback we will say that uh, app is listening on port 5000 so now we also need to set the view engine guys so app set view view engine we have installed it ejs and also when we open the home page app.get home route we need to show the user the form so here this will be response.render and here we will show the index.ejs file for this we need to create the views folder and inside this we need to create index.ejs file so this will be a simple html document so here we will change the title get channel id and video id so here we will have the simple form first this will be get id we will say and the method will be post 
and here we will give the label enter channel URL or video URL so now we will give the input input type of text so here we will give the channel URL first of all we will build it for the channel URL so here we will say get channel ID this is the post request and we will have one other form for the video ID so this will go to get video ID and here we will say enter video URL name attribute will change to video URL and both these parameters are required to submit it and then we will have a simple button input type submit and here we will say get ID sorry get video ID and this time this will be get channel ID so now if I open this at port 5000 you will see two forms here get channel ID and get video ID so we can have some spacing here just to have so now we can make these post requests guys so simply now to working with forms we also need to uh, include the body parser middleware which is uh, built in in express you did not have to install it so body parser app.use body parser dot url encode it extend it to false dot json so write these two lines this is very much important if you are working with forms and now we can get the values which the user has entered first for the get channel id request and here we can get uh, we can call the method so we can include the dependency so just include this so so here we can call our channel id method and here we can pass the channel url which is coming from request or dot dot channel url and this will return a promise this will get the id and uh, now we can pass this ID to the template by using response.render index and then we can pass the ID channel ID to the channel ID and also when we load this for the very first time the channel ID will be empty and the video ID will also be empty so here we also say video ID will also be empty so now we need to create this uh, print out this channel ID right here so simply we will say we will give a heading here inside uh, first of all we will check in the if, if condition if channel ID exist if channel ID exist in that case only we need to print out this condition so this is the syntax in ejx in order to print out variables so inside this if condition we will say inside our h1 tag your channel id is and then we can print out the variable which is channel id So now if I look at, if I uh, pass the channel URL, so if I take the example, this is a channel ID, you will see if I copy this channel ID, or oh sorry, copy channel URL, click get channel ID, so it is saying channel ID is not defined. 
sorry this needs to be id that was the problem so let me refresh it click get channel id so you will see your channel id is this so this is you can simply copy it and let me verify it for you let me copy paste this channel id here like this so you can see this is a uh, sorry the format is incorrect like this so this is actual channel id let me see coding six so basically it will give you this is a username that you see So basically it will give you this channel ID which is correct for this individual channel and uh, basically you can do it for any channel and same will go for uh, the video ID. You can pick any other channel as well. So if you pick this channel, copy paste this uh, channel URL inside this tool, paste it, your channel ID is this. And same goes for the video ID as well. So basically, if you're making any sort of API request, you, you will need this channel ID. So numeric channel ID, not username. So in that case, it will be important. And now we will make the same use case for the video ID as well. So the post request will be like this. This will change to get video ID. This will be video URL. And uh, this will be do nothing. This will be video ID to be ID. And same condition we will have for this. This will be for video ID. So your video ID is this video ID. That's it. So now you can take the example of a particular video also. So if you go to YouTube, simply copy paste this URL and paste it inside this tool. So this is the, um, let me see. Oh, sorry this needs to be video ID method so once again refresh it so yes see video ID is not defined let me see video ID slash get video id slash get channel id let me refresh it so it is saying index.js at 28 line so this line video url mm, i don't know why the problem is occurring it should work i have shown you i think this is the correct code i think my internet connection is not working so that is why it is not doing for this one all the source code will be there inside video description guys so Oh, sorry I think this is a problem video ID this needs to be capital video ID like this because we imported like this so once again if you refresh it hopefully this should now work your video ID is like this so you can see that it now it is working so I have given all the source code in the video description so download all the source code 
please hit the like button subscribe the channel and i will be seeing you in the next video